This is NDTV. And you're watching NDTV Hindu. This Friday the 13th, however unlucky it may have been for the Dravidian heavyweight still today, the DMK belonged to comeback queen JJ Lalita. Putting an end to the political exile, Amma is waving the victory sign as she will get set to form the new government in the state of Tamil Nadu. You are watching this special show, Seat of Power on NDTV Hindu. We join you with a celebration, the introspection and the road ahead for the Tamil Nadu government in the next 30 minutes. Before that, a look at our headlines. A triumphant Jayalalitha emerges with her victory sign as the AIA DMK leads by a massive margin of 200 Amma hours to restore this law and order in the state. Not for us, but in reality, for the people of Tamil Nadu. This is a victory for democracy. A despondent M. Karunanidhi accepts his fate and submits his resignation, says the state of Tamil Nadu has given him rest. <laughs> Appearing anxious, the daughter of the outgoing Chief Minister Kanyamuri responds to the people's verdict hours away from the big 2 spectrum test in New decided. Delhi. All lights, camera and action from Poe's Garden tonight. The Carders, Babus and star-studded wishes pile up for the third time Chief Minister. Uh, that's why he sent us personally to wish her uh, all the best and that he's very happy about the, whatever the result has been. <laughs> Victory for Amma does not stop with Tamil Nadu, AIADMK's ally and Puducherry, the AINRC is all set to sweep the assembly elections there too. And Mamta Didi derails the left from their stronghold West Bengal, similar trend seen in Kerala, but it might end in a photo finish. In what has turned out to be the mother of all elections over the past few months, Jay Lalita has emerged as the supreme winner. Our executive editor Sanjay Pinto catches the mood, the pulse and the aura of the victory tonight. The Chennai Super Queen has notched up a double century. What's more? She doesn't need the captain, her ally Vijay Kant, for her five-year innings in Tamil Nadu. Having emerged as a second largest party, the DMDK chief may well end up as a leader of the opposition. While the customary vote for change may have been predicted in the state, few expected the AIA DMK to sweep this election and get a majority on its own. The DMK that's been clean bold was obviously both haunted and hurt by the 2G scam. And a jubilant Amma believes that the voters have delivered a decisive verdict against corruption. Renovation of a house involves just giving the house a coat of paint. But when the house itself has been damaged and knocked down, and when the debris are strewn all around, and you have to first clear away the debris, and then rebuild the entire house. That could be a warning of investigation into projects undertaken by the DMK regime. And this is the most visible sign of the change of guard in the state. Here is practically the entire bureaucracy waiting for an audience with their new boss. Michael may not be part of this winning alliance, but the crackers from his constituency, Sivakasi, is certainly part of the celebration. And while the tremors in Tamil Nadu are being felt now, the big question is whether the aftershocks will also be felt in New Delhi very soon. Observers believe there could be a big question mark over the DMK Congress relationship. So what are the repercussions you believe of this verdict in New Delhi? What is the role that the AIA DMK would be playing? Would be in opposition? Would be, uh... Today, our priority is to form the government the new cabinet is likely to be sworn in on Sunday and Jay Lalita seems set to take strike from the old Fort St. George and not the new secretariat, which she once said resembles the hat of a Puducherry policeman. In Chennai, 
with camera person Sagai Raj. This is Sanjay Pinto for NDTV. So it's all set for the two leaves to carve into the victorious V sign for the greener camp, forcing the son of the DMK to set in gloom. The DMK chief has been among the very few from the side after these uh, clear, clean and clear signs of uh, defeat to really react. Here's what he said today. <laughs> So, Jaya Lalita may have fought the elections gone by Bab by political Bab, but the DMK patriarch fought this year's assembly elections with his back to the wall. The 2G scandal and the arrest of party leader and former central minister A. Raja came too close to the polls for comfort. The DMK and the Congress party officers wore a deserted look since morning as trends showed they were heading for a rout. DMK's chief Karunanidhi submitted his resignation to the Tamil Nadu governor, Surjit Singh Barnala. The governor on his part has accepted the resignation. However, the DMK patriarch has been requested to continue functioning along with the Council of Ministers till alternate arrangements are made. The Rajya Sabha MP from uh, the DMK and the daughter of the outgoing chief minister, Ms. Karnimuri, has reacted saying that she has accepted the people's verdict. Uh, your initial reactions on the DMK's verdict, ma'am? We accept whatever the people have decided. And uh, ma'am, uh, do you think, uh, what is the road ahead for the DMK, ma'am? Uh, uh, ma'am, one, please ask the leader about it. And ma'am, do you think this particular result will have an impact uh, tomorrow, ma'am? Well, the VCK chief uh, didn't stray from that note either. Here's what Tolturuma Valavan had to say in reaction to this landslide win for his political rival. Satrum Yedrubarada Mudu Hill Makal Medu Nambi Kivetu Timukaras in Southern Hill in Medu Nambi Kivetu Ureto Anal Mudu Hill Yedrubarada Hale Amindra Kandana. Makal Varangir Kratirpe, Talavanangi Air to Kulhoro Kutani Aras, Tamilakatil, Amaivadi, Tamanad Makal, Burumba Villa and Badu in the Mudu Hill Lirundan and Unar Grasaviaha, Nambure. Todan the Angal Makal Paniatuum in the Aras, Pudida Hamever Kra, Timukaras, Kadan the Timukaras, Arivit, Nadamari Padatia, Makal and the Titanganatim. Kaivitu Vidamal, Todandu, Nadatha Vendum, and the Varpurtuom Atimuka, Arasin, Nalatitangel, Eduakaran Dharma, the other people. Meanwhile, Amma's ally for the summer polls, Vijay Kant, was not far uh, from proving his popularity either. Captain won from the Rishivandiam seat today after the massive mandate. Captain may not give his winning team the match winning strokes. In Makalakum, in Dundalakum, in the Vitri. Belivasi Vyarbu, current ticket, young Mudal, team Kavin Arajagam, the Landa Makalke, either Unon children, Kasu Gurta, Voto Angela, Nanachangle, Adi in the third of the failure, twelve years ago, Kasu Gurta, Voto Angam Mudia. So amidst the mood uh, that's been building up by the minute, senior leader of the AIA, DMK, Dr. V. Maitreyan spoke to NDTV Hindu senior correspondent, Peer Muhammad. Let's listen in to what he had to say. It's a landslide victory for the ADMK-led alliance in Tamil Nadu. We are now joined by ADMK MB, uh, Maitreyan. He will talk about the victory of the ADMK. Sir, what do you feel about this victory? Is it? It's a very decisive victory. It's a decisive AD. victory. It's a landslide victory. It's a positive mandate for Madam, and it's a J tsunami, which has totally decimated the DMK. Sir, do you think it is a combination of the freebies offer and also the 2G scam that has seen this victory of the ADMK? The one family misrule and one family domination in all spheres of life in Tamil Nadu has made the people of Tamil Nadu so much agitated that they were waiting for an opportunity to press the button. And when they pressed the button, they pressed it with a bang. Well, 
Yeah. Senior leaders who can hardly keep away from all of that excitement. They are all set for the change of guard. Ms. Badar Saeed, uh, for one, was not surprised with today's win. An expected mandate. We knew this would happen. The, considering the situation in the state, considering that, you know, the people, the citizens of Tamil Nadu, we've had no dignity. There's been no freedom. Well, it were not uh, just the AIA, DMK members and the workers joining in to wish Ms. Jalalita for the sweeping victory. But the stars and star children had also descended on Poe's garden. Here's what a couple of them had to say. We are very, very happy about uh, what the results have been and we just came to wish her and we are very excited about this whole thing. And what is the message from your dad to her? Um, I would first like to say he's perfectly fine and to uh, tell you that uh, all the rumours about his health has been absolutely wrong because uh, of all these today's that it, today that it came out was really, really unfortunate because he's one of the one of the people who's really happy for her today and uh, that's why he sent us personally to wish her uh, all the best and that he's very happy about the whatever the result has been. So please, please don't believe any rumours. He's hale and healthy and very happy for her. And here's what actor Vijay had to also say at the Poe's Garden. I am very happy to be here in Tamil Nadu. I am very happy to be here in Tamil Nadu. I am very happy to be here in Tamil Nadu. I am very happy to be here in Tamil Nadu. I am very happy to be here in Tamil Nadu. I am very happy to be here in Tamil Nadu. I am very happy to be here in Tamil Nadu. I am very happy to be here in Tamil Nadu. I am very happy to be here in Tamil Nadu. Plenty more updates and news from the city and the state on the poll results on the seat of power that's up on the other side.